Hello again, everyone. Edwin Lerner back once again. In this YouTube NFL prediction segment, I'm going to be giving you my pick and analysis for the 2016 Week 10 matchup between the Cincinnati Bengals and the New York Giants. Well, anyway, I'm going to take the New York Giants to win at home in this one. Giants have been playing much better in recent weeks. They are 3-1 at home. They would have been a flawless 4-1, 4-0 at home. But they did lose to the Washington Redskins by two points, a game I felt they should have won. I believe Washington won in the closing moments of that game. And the thing about it is the Giants seem to be clicking on all cylinders right now. Uh, Landon uh, Collins... The safety, one of the safeties for the team is three interceptions. He has played well, very well recently. Now, the New York Giants, too, it seems like their resurgence, a lot of this is attributed to Odell Beckham Jr., a wide receiver on the team. And they, and now he hasn't exactly played in, at a phenomenal level the last th three weeks. However, I think what's happened is, as many of you know, he had... There were some issues going on with him. They may still be going on with him, but going through some certain turmoil. But it seemed like what, what's happened is in recent weeks, he hasn't allowed it to impact him on the field. And maybe he, maybe there was some game that he was involved in where he had a little bit of a blow up. And I think that that could have actually in an odd way might have been advantageous to the Giants and the team because with Odell Beckham, I think after that it allowed him to become introspective and look at himself and understand what was happening and that whatever issues he was going through was impacting his performance on the field. And now since I, I think it's at a point where at least it's not affecting his play. Now, the New York Giants... Also, I mean, they've had their three-game winning streak. They have played very well during that time. And the thing about the Giants, though, this is their Achilles heel is their rushing. They're dead last in the NFL in rushing yards per game at about 68. And running back Rashad Jennings was held to 26 yards last week. And even though they've gotten by with great passing from Eli Manning. It seems like this is a very strong passing offense team. They're going to have to do a little bit better in the running department this week. I think they may very well do so. Uh, a lot of that is because, now you look at the Cincinnati Bengals, their run defense is 23rd in the NFL. They're giving up about 116 yards per game. If Rashad Jennings could get anything close to 100, that will definitely ameliorate and enhance their chances of winning this game. Now, the Bengals, on the other hand, seem like they're going in another direction than the Giants are. The Bengals are 1-2-1 one, and one in their last four games. That one lone win in that period was against the Browns. The They are also 1-3 and three on the road, and the only victory the Bengals have on the road this season was in week one against my New York Jets. And the thing about the Bengals too though is that in this particular game, Giants cornerbacks will have to be play really exceptional in this one because despite the Bengals struggles uh, this season, uh, wide receiver A.J. Green is number two in receiving yards in the NFL and he's also number one in receptions. And Despite the fact that the Bengals have lost some receivers during the offseason or what have you, they're still in about the middle of the pack in, in the league in terms of uh, receptions, uh, 193. Can you imagine what they'd be doing if they actually had those other players with them that they did lose? It's obviously been to their detriment. I think it's played a role in why they're, they're really only like a mediocre team right now based on their record. If tight end Tyler Eifert, if he is, uh, if he's plays, uh, if he's at 100% in this game, then it, obviously that will help the Cincinnati Bengals and their chances of winning. But I just don't really like the way they're playing right now. The Bengals, their scoring defense is a little bit worse than the Giants. Giants are number 10 in the league in scoring defense, and the Bengals are number 19 in the league, giving up nearly 24 points per game. And the thing about this game is going to be a critical matchup. 
Uh, I don't know who's going to be covering the Giants wide receiver Odell Beckham. I'm thinking it might be cornerback Dre Kirkpatrick. And Odell Beckham uh, Jr., I do believe he will win the matchup and play very well in this particular contest. And I think along with the other things I said, that will give the Giants uh, the win this week. The Giants are just simply playing better than the Bengals right now. The Giants seem like they have turned things around. They have played very well at home. And I think they will continue to do so in this game. So I'm going to take the New York Giants to win at home over the Cincinnati Bengals. Well, anyway, people, that'll conclude this YouTube NFL prediction segment for my 2016 Week 10 uh, preview of the game between the Cincinnati Bengals and the New York Giants. And until next time, people, Edwin Leonard saying stay well.